I see my leadership style as being collaborative. I see it as being open and still evolving and unfolding. I tell students all the time that things will happen, but you need to pick yourself up and keep going. And if I didn't do that, then I would not be serving as the president of this university in the way that I encourage students to grow and develop. Judy Sakaki is from Oakland. And what that means is that she's a real person. She will, she listens, she understands history. She did a fantastic thing when she was being installed as the president, bringing an exhibition of some of her possessions from her family history with the encampments during World War II. I think being the first Japanese American woman president of a four-year university in the country, um, I was surprised when I learned that when someone told me. But I feel an incredible responsibility with that, to serve as a role model and to mentor others who are coming up. I have been lifted myself by many people, and I feel a responsibility to want to reach back. Whenever you see her, if you have walked into a situation where she's speaking with students, you'll see her smiling and laughing and taking selfies with them. She's very enthusiastic. Her career was through student services, so she's very directly connected with the students and their experience and what they're trying to accomplish by attending the university. She may be small, but she's mighty, and she fights for students on this campus. She fights for women on this campus to go up in leadership, and she's just constantly that figure that everyone looks towards, and. She's so inspirational. Many people say, oh, well, as president, you're the leader. But actually, everyone can lead. You can lead from anywhere in an organization that you are. You have an opportunity to make a difference, and you lead your coworkers, students. I like to think that the whole campus is a leadership team. We are all leading and getting better.